Top 25 Quality Engineer Interview Questions and Answers Quality Engineer or also known as Quality Assurance Engineer, Quality Control Engineer or Senior Quality Specialist is a position responsible for ensuring the overall quality standards established for certain products or services are met. Aside from monitoring tasks, they are in charge of documenting and resolving issues that occurred. To conclude, this role is indispensable in any company, hence you might want to ace the interview if you are interested to grow your career in this field. In this article, we will look at 25 probable interview questions that may be asked for this position along with the answers. Let's start preparing for the interviews now. 1. Why are you interested in this role? Be high-spirited in displaying your motivation and passion for the job offered. Sample answer. I am very passionate about software and have always strived to ensure everyone has a good experience with software. I deeply enjoy the challenge of ensuring all software under my supervision is able to function at its best. Besides, I have immense interest and passion in exploring as well as providing the best new methods that may ease the roles of other software engineers. 2. What makes you qualify for this job? Display what points differentiate you from other candidates applying for the same position. Sample answer. I hold a bachelor's degree in engineering and in recent years, I have attended and acquired several certifications which boosted up my qualification in this field. I am someone who possesses an immense interest in this field and strives to provide the best experience for software consumers. A company with almost three years of experience in this field, I believe I could bring good changes to this company. 3. What are the roles of a quality engineer? Aside from background experience, it would be helpful to study a bit on the other roles for this job title. Sample answer. A quality engineer is someone who has to work hand in hand with different teams, such as manufacturers, developers, and managers. They are in charge of coming up with the processes on how to achieve and implement quality assurance and quality control for the certain products or projects they are working on. Another key role is to make sure the standards established for the products are achieved. 4. What are the qualities needed to be a successful quality engineer? In answering this question, stay on track with the nature and roles of a quality engineer. Sample answer. To become an effective quality engineer, one should be equipped with critical thinking because they need to perform analysis and finding out the cause of problems followed with the ways to address the issue. Another needed skill is to be able to work under pressure. This is because quality engineer has to stay organized and may be flooded with many tasks at the same time. 5. What are the challenges you once had in the past related to this field? This question will display your experience and problem-solving skills. Sample answer. One of the challenges I had in this field is the flooding of data. In my early years working in this field, I find it tough to filter the data accordingly. I was quite disorganized with my data collection and turns out recording irrelevant data, which slows down the pace of data analysis. As time passes, I managed to resolve this issue with guidance from my colleagues and after attending related courses and training. 6. How do you deal with uncooperative workers? This question will test your interpersonal and leadership skills. Sample answer. If I were in the same position as the worker, I would first talk to the person in question nicely. It may help to figure out the circumstances that were hindering them from doing their work well. If the behavior persists, I may need to ask for intervention from more senior colleagues or managers. 7. How do you describe quality engineering in the simplest words? For this question, you must assume that the listener is genuinely not familiar with the job. Sample answer. Quality engineering is one of the components of engineering, which is highly related to ensuring the products released are of high quality. For every product or service offered, there are standards that ought to be achieved and to determine either the products are of high quality or not. Quality engineering is involved in establishing the standards as well as ensuring the goals are achieved. 8. Share your daily routine as a quality engineer. This question might display your competence and productivity as a quality engineer. Sample answer. As a quality engineer, I was assigned to develop the quality standards of the product every time a new project started. This was done with discussion from all related sectors when developing a product. Another daily task is monitoring the progress of the project and coming up with corrective actions for any issues that occur within the processes. 9. What kind of strategies and mindset are required for this role? Providing good answers may reveal your motivation to work on a longer term as the position offered. 
Sample answer. My mindset in this role is to be alert at all times and must never take this job lightly. That aside, when choosing software, for example, I would always remind myself to look at the consumer or user's perspective. It should be noted that I may find the products good for me, but they may not be for the others. Hence, one of the strategies is to always look at a different perspective. 10. What is the biggest challenge you foresee in this job? Employers will seek candidates who has a great envision for the upcoming hurdles that may be faced in the future. Sample answer. One of the challenges that may be faced among quality engineers is insufficient quality and production planning. All quality engineers must be able to provide comprehensive and detailed planning to address any issue that may obstruct the processes for the team. Risk analysis should also be done aside from providing a corrective plan to be adhered by the team members. Hence, they must be able to track and think of any possible deficiency that may happen in any products produced. 11. How do you stay motivated at work? It is best to provide your personal motivation, but try to relate as much as possible to job-related answers. Sample answer. I always like to set up deadlines and milestones for my job. Doing this will bring me a sense of accomplishment and makes me more motivated to keep doing my job well. Aside from setting deadlines for my job, I always jot down my success criteria. For example, getting approval from my manager. 12. Describe a time you failed in this role and the lesson you learned. Be upfront and display that you will not repeat any more major mistakes. Sample answer. One of the times that hugely shaped me into who I am today was when I excitedly accepted to work for multiple tasks at the same time. I was working on one task when my manager offered me another task, which has been my aim for a long time. Since it was my first time doing it, it took quite some time for me to learn the ways to perform the tasks. In the end, I had to ask for my colleagues' help just to meet deadlines. 13. Share with us one of the biggest conflicts you faced in the past. This question will gauge your problem-solving skills. Sample answer. I think the biggest conflict I had in the past was to compromise with the vendor who was not meeting our deadlines. Their quality generally met our standards, there were many times where they missed our deadlines. I was one of the persons who was asked to discuss the matter with the supplier. It was my first time dealing with that kind of conflict. 14. Share with us your greatest achievement. This question is asked to provide the gist of your work ethic and priorities for jobs. Sample answer. My biggest achievement was when I volunteered to perform a task that was quite tough among other team members. The initial person in charge was on leave due to personal issues, but we were caught up with deadlines. It was my first experience working on that task, and I worked really hard to find solutions and ways to perform the task. It was a great experience for me and well accepted by the manager. 15. Share your experience dealing with code quality. You may display your experience to boost your chance of getting hired. Sample answer. I was one of the persons in charge of differentiating and identifying the best code to be implemented in my previous team. We were tasked to test the efficiency of quite a number of codes at that time. There are some metrics that we use to measure code quality, such as reliability, testability, reusability, and complexity. 16. Why do you think code quality is important? A good candidate should be able to understand the importance of quality-related topics. Sample answer. Code quality is important so that we can identify which coding is the best to be implemented depending on the context. Errors in coding may lead to unnecessary risks. Code quality will also ensure the sturdiness and sustainability of the software. This may provide the best experience for the users. 17. In your opinion, what are the examples of quality metrics? A candidate who strives to get accepted should be able to be familiar with some important metrics in determining quality. Sample answer. Some of the examples of quality metrics are cost control, the frequency of defects, and the automaticity of the performance. Another metric is the rate of failure or error happening. These are some of the examples of quality metrics that I often prioritize for the products we are working on. 18. How do you prioritize when there are a lot of tasks to be done at one time? A good worker should be able to organize their time and prioritize well. Sample answer. Whenever I am flooded with many tasks at one time, I will list down all the tasks properly. Then I will categorize them according to the approaching deadlines and difficulties, as well as the criticality of the job. Considering all these three aspects, 
I will determine which task to work on earlier than the others. 19. Are you familiar with any software to ease the tasks related to quality management? One should be able to know some software or technology for the job offered. Sample answer. There is some software that I am familiar with ever since using them during study and in my previous workplace. I have used Altex soft for quality management before. I am currently exploring more software available in the market, such as Cordy QMS and Integrum. I enjoy trying out different software since some software may have features that are not available in other software. 20. How will you deal with people who do not abide by the quality standards? This question tests your communication and leadership skills. Sample answer. I will first investigate the root cause of the issue. There must be something wrong with the person if that is the first underperforming record. I will approach the person and remind them to keep on track with the standards. If the issue persists, depending on my position, I may need to have the person replaced. 21. What would you do if you notice errors or defects? This question tests your problem-solving skills. Sample answer. I will identify the root cause of the error first. Then, it is best to consult with the managers and the team in charge of performing the tasks where the errors originated from. If the error is major, I may need to inform for the processes to be stopped for a while. 22. What are the key components of a quality plan? Aside from technical works, you should be familiar with documenting tasks. Sample answer. Some of the things that should be included are the team members and the responsibilities assigned. The quality standards of the product or service should also be included clearly. The other things include the testing and quality assurance, the risks, design control, as well as control development. 23. Do you think meeting centering quality is important? Provide your earnest opinion on holding meetings and the advantages. Sample answer. Yes, I believe meetings should be done regularly. Holding meetings can help track the progress of the product. It can also ensure that everyone is on the same page and the quality standards are clearly relayed among all teams involved. 24. Aside from monitoring what other methods help to gain insights on the product, a creative thinking worker is a plus point. Sample answer. Aside from monitoring, I highly recommend obtaining feedback. The most useful information may be gained among users, employees, and consumers. We may want to launch a pre-release prototype to ask for opinions and reviews from others. This may provide insights for improvement. 25. How will you handle complaints from customers? This question will display your problem-solving and customer service skills. Sample answer. I will first listen to the complaints by the customer. If the issue is within my capabilities, I will provide assistance to the customer. It could be either in the form of providing other options for the service. However, if the issue is quite big, I may need help from more senior colleagues or managers. To summarize, this article has provided 25 interview questions and answers if you want to apply for a quality engineer position. It should be noted that the questions asked in interviews may differ from the list given. However, we hope this article is helpful in providing you insights and preparing for your interviews. We wish you all the best in your future endeavor.